As we've been following the life of David through the book of 2 Samuel, it's very clear that David had some amazing times of victory and experiencing the faithfulness of God. And there's other times where he's on the run, where it looks like all is lost for David. But it's interesting, as we come to 2 Samuel 22 today, we see David's heart, really his soul, settled in the faithfulness of God. This chapter today, it almost reads like a book from the book of Psalms. It's a psalm of praise. Let me read to you David's perspective on his life in light of following God through the ups and the downs. He says in verse one, the Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my savior. My God is my rock in whom I find protection. He's my shield, the power that saves me and my place of safety. He's my refuge, my savior, the one who saves me from violence. I called on the Lord who is worthy of praise and he saved me from my enemies. Throughout all of David's life, through his trials, through his times of triumph, he constantly leaned on the Lord for his source of protection. Not looking to the left, not looking to the right for someone or something else to place his trust in, but to place his trust in the Lord. And in verse 31, he tells us why. He says, God's way is perfect. All the Lord's promises prove true. He is a shield for all who look to him for protection. For who is God except the Lord? Who but our God is a solid rock? This morning, today, as you read this chapter, let these words from a man who followed after God and saw his faithfulness warm your heart and encourage your spirit and remind yourself that God is faithful, that all his ways are perfect. You can constantly and consistently look to him for guidance, for protection, for provision and direction in all seasons of your life.